Brian Painter of the Oklahoman. Thank you for joining us for this segment in a series in which we're talking with Oklahomans who are in professional baseball. The whole purpose of the series is to provide insight for you, the player, the coach, the fan. Today I'm joined by Greg Harrell. Greg's an assistant athletic trainer for the Los Angeles Dodgers last year and this upcoming season. He's been a professional baseball trainer since 1986. Thanks very much for joining me. Thanks for having me. Greg, you know, I, I think one thing that sometimes players don't realize is the importance of running, throwing, stretching before a game. Uh, you know, during infield, outfield, they'll get more reputations than they will during a game. How important is that pre-game or pre-practice uh, stretching and all? Uh, it, it's very important, important with injury prevention. It's uh, important to have their, their bodies ready for what they're going to do. Uh, if, if you're a fan and you come to our games and you get there early enough into the into the stadium, whether it's spring training or regular season, and you see that you're early, there early enough to see the players stretch before batting practice or before the game, what a lot of people don't realize, even they're out there doing that on the field, there's like a, a, a active warm-up, uh, people call it different things that's been done by most players inside the weight room and inside the conditioning center. Uh, that we have where there are, they're doing stuff to get their blood flowing even before they go out on the field. So what, what you see on the field is you should be pretty good, but most of those guys have already done something before they even go out there. And it's like we talked before with the other things of conditioning. Some people we have to, to push to, to, to make sure that they get ready. A lot of times the younger players uh, maybe seem to feel they're in, invincible or don't see the importance of it. And once they you know, tweak a hammy or do something like that, they figure it out in a hurry how important it is. You know, the first pitch at Chavez Ravine, maybe at 7, 7.30 or something like that, but you probably have guys showing up middle of the day. Uh, some, some guys getting there very early, starting on their own really early in the day. Is that correct? Well, on a typical day, like a 7 o'clock game at home, uh, last year I was typically at the field by 11.30, sometimes earlier. Some of that's to do with some of my personal stuff. But we have uh, players that show up as, as early as, as 12.30 for a 7 o'clock game. Uh, some, a lot of times the guys who are injured or have something going on, you know, they feel a commitment and they, they, they're there earlier than we even tell them to be. That happens quite, quite often. All right. Thanks very much. Thank you.